you reckon with? Can they do it again? Hi, everybody. I'm Bruce Rader. After 12 days off, the Norfolk State basketball team is looking to wrap up its MEAC regular season with two games against Maryland Eastern Shore and two games against Delaware State. The Spartans, who are the only team in the MEAC with less than two conference losses, will host Maryland Eastern Shore tomorrow night at Joe Eccles Hall at 6 o'clock and then head up to Delaware next week. It's been another great year for Coach Robert Jones and his team, and he joins us tonight here on the Sports Wrap. Coach, I know it's not over yet, but it's nice to be in first place in mid-February. Yeah, it's great to be in first place. You know, the only team in the conference with only one loss. Everyone else has more than that. So, you know, we have a little cushion. I think we have a game and a half cushion as of right now. So we want to try to extend that cushion this weekend. And it's nice to have Joe Bryant Jr. on your team, the top scorer in the MEAC and only eight points away from reaching a thousand points in his career. Yeah, he's a, a testament to a kid that has uh, stayed the course. You know, in this day and age, these kids transfer, they leave, you know, they go do, try to do something that they think is better for them. And he stayed the course all four years, and now he's going to be a thousand point scorer, and he should be able to get that very shortly. But your team's not just about scoring, they play pretty good defense. Yeah, I think that we're like number five in the country with field goal percentage defense as of today. So um, that's top five in the country. And, you know, I guess the only way you can be any better is you're number one. So top five, I'll take it. Looking back to last year, that exciting win in the first round of the NCAA tournament down in Indiana, and then the great exposure that you had in the second game playing top seed Gonzaga. Oh, that was a tremendous experience. You know, um, to win an NCAA tournament game, there's been a lot of great players, a lot of great coaches that never have made it to the NCAA tournament, let alone win a game. So to win that game, I'll forever cherish that until maybe the next one. And congratulations to you being named coach of the HBCU team in the college basketball all-star game in Columbus, Ohio in April. What an honor. No, it was great. You know, I'm humbled and honored. You know, there's a, a lot of HBCU coaches all across the country, a lot of good HBCU coaches across the country. And for them to, to be chosen to lead that game, um, it's been tremendous. All right, nine years as head coach at Norfolk State. Robert Jones with another championship caliber team. Coach, thanks for being with us. Yeah, Check them out this weekend.